I want to try to answer some questions in that Excel assignment. I'm going to show you how to put in some formulas and make sure that you understand how to use your fill and how to also how to select cells. To begin with, I want to add um, all the weeks totals together. Or, uh, put in the weeks total for, for each day of the week. So I'm going to add together days one through seven, put the total here, and I use that name as a common sum. Notice I select the range first. I'm going to select the range here, I'm going to press right to draw a cell, and then I'm going to click on the auto sum. In this cell, C21, I want to get the average of days one through seven. So I'm going to be click on the drop down next to the auto sum and choose average and select the range for days one through seven. The next one that you may have questions about is the median. And there are some videos that I have posted links to under the Excel demos on the Microsoft website. And the one that they suggest using is the autocomplete. So I'm going to type the equal sign, and I know that the, the function is median, and I get the autocomplete. So I click it, it puts the, me the median function in, and I select the range. So that might be the easiest way to get it. There are other ways as well, um, but that was the one that was explained in the demo. And I encourage you to look at the demos, they're very helpful. I'm finishing up here, putting in the other fu functions. And then I'm going to select the range and then use the autocomplete for the fill. Here I want the total for um, all of the grades in row J, the total of those on auto sum again. And then here I want to get the percent sales. And the percent sales is each day's, um, each item's week total divided by a total of all four items. That's going to be the percent of each one of those. So I'm going to click on the equal sign. J5 and my division sign, and look where I'm getting the total C26. I'm going to press F4 on the top row of the keyboard because I need to make C26 absolute so that when I copy it down, C26 remains unchanged. However, the J5 will turn to J6 and J6 to J7, J7 to J8. So that this part, this is called the mixed reference, this part is relative, the other part is absolute. And I'm going to use the auto. This is helpful.